There are a number of reasons an electrical outlet might need to be replaced. The outlet may have a cracked receptacle, yellowing due to age, or may not be producing power. We're going to show you how to replace an electrical outlet. But before starting, be sure you're comfortable working with electrical wires. There's an easy way to test your outlet's power. Plug something into it to see if it produces power. If your outlet isn't producing power, it may need to be replaced. To start, turn off the power for the circuit at the breaker box. And use the voltage tester to confirm the outlet is off. Use the screwdriver to remove the faceplate and outlet mounting screws. Then, gently pull the outlet from the wall. The black wire is typically the hot wire that conducts live voltage. It connects to the brass screw terminals. The neutral wires are white and connect to the silver screw terminals. The grounding wires may be copper wires or green coated wires. These wires connect to the green screws on the outlet. Unscrew the terminals and pull away the wires. Make sure you keep the wire loops intact to make it easier to install your new receptacle. The amperage of the new outlet should match the amperage of the old outlet. Attach the wires to the new outlet exactly the way the old wires were attached. Copper wires will connect to the green screw terminal. White wires will connect to a silver screw terminal. And black wires connect to a brass screw terminal. Gently push the outlet back into the box and tighten the mounting screws. Check that the receptacle is level and put the wall plate back on. Finally, turn the power back on and test the outlet with the voltage tester. Now that you've added replacing an outlet to your list of skills, you'll be able to quickly restore power to any room in your house. Here is a list of tools and materials. Good luck and thanks for shopping at the Home Depot.